Oh, this is amazing. Bobby is still back there? Oh, yeah. He loves it. All that fresh air, the wind blowing through his feathers. I think this has been our greatest adventure of all time. Bobby thinks so, too. <laughs> uh, um, nom, 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 nom. Another day to live through. Better get started. Welcome back to Myth Survival. We're picking up just about where we left off here in the Redneck Shack in the city within the uh, the confines of the motel property. Nice and safe back here behind these walls and our little chicken fence. <gasps> oh, chicken fence. That reminds me of Bobby. Old Bobby, the redneck chicken. Redneck therapy chicken, I should say. And if Bobby were here, he would have woken us up a lot sooner than 8.30 in the morning. Yeah, so we need Bobby. We gotta go get Bobby back. He's our alarm clock. Clark. Alarm Clark. <laughs> and he'll wake us up nice and bright and early so we have the whole day ahead of us to go do stuff. And that's uh, what we're gonna do today. We're gonna go, we're gonna go fetch Bobby. But first... We need to unload everything in this car because there is a new car out in the game now. It is a pickup truck. It was added over the weekend in a patch. And uh, we are going to go find it today. And as far as I know, you can put objects in the back of the pickup truck. And I'm thinking maybe we can stuff Bobby in there and then bring him here. Bring him back where he belongs with us at the Redneck Shack. And we might even be able to get a workbench in there, too. I'm not really sure about that, but we sure are going to try. Oh, boy. We have so much stuff. You know what? We can drop stuff in this game and, and leave it on the ground. It does stick around. So let's leave the sticks. Get it? Stick around, sticks. And don't leave, leaves. <laughs> but dum bum -ch. Dead jokes. They're the best. All right. Looks good. Let's go. Better shut that door. I don't want any randit sneaking in here and stealing our stuff. We're setting up an ambush while we're away, so <laughs> let's make sure all the doors are closed. And sooner or later, we'll have walls put up here to block them from our uh, our motel property 100%. And by the way, apparently I put this on the wrong side, the wrong orientation. I think the metal's supposed to be on the outside. <laughs> I don't think it really makes any difference other than looks, but uh, I don't know. I might turn it around, I might not. I'll have to chop it down and rebuild. No big deal. Anyway, hop in, I'm driving. Let's go get a pickup truck and Bobby and a workbench. And away we go. So as far as I know, the degradation of vehicle parts has been disabled with this particular update because apparently the pickup truck was burning through car parts really quickly so the developer decided just to shut that part off um, and gas will apparently respawn now every 30 60 and 90 days in cars so you can siphon it out at least until he adds a method of making your own gasoline which is coming so we don't have to worry about car parts melting but we do have to worry about them getting shot by snipers so step on the gas i wish it were a horn i really want to beep Beep, 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 and taunt them. All right, so this, uh, the pickup truck is in two different locations, as far as I know. And I'm 100% positive about one of the locations. There's a, uh, like a trailer uh, campsite over here by the lake, which is very close by. We'll go check that out. And hopefully that other sniper behind us isn't taking pot shots at us either. I don't think so. Very good. All right, we made it. Now, I think it's down here. One of these campsites. There's a big dock right there. It's not what we want. Just don't go in the water. This is our only transportation at the moment. <laughs> so apparently this pickup truck is really buggy. People have been having some issues with it. Flopping around and uh, flipping over. So hopefully we don't have uh, issues like that. Bobby? Bobby! Oh, you're not Bobby, you imposter. Bobby wouldn't run from us. Definitely not Bobby, although I wouldn't mind eating that chicken. All right, well, we got some loots here, but there's no, um, clearly no pickup truck, although this isn't one of the sites I was thinking of anyway. How about a shotgun on the roof of the camper? No, sometimes you find shotguns on the roofs of these campers, so worth looking. Stop taunting me, you're not the right Bobby. I will shoot you. What do we got here? Ooh, cans of beef. 
Can't go wrong with cans of beef. In fact, how are we doing for food? Eh, we're okay right now. Let's drag and drop that down there, though. Save on space. And I'm hoping this pickup truck has some uh, some trunk space. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. But we're gonna have to um, we're gonna have to dismantle this car, unfortunately, to fix up the pickup truck, and that's gonna take some time. Oh wait, this cabin right here does that have a backpack in it? Uh, I'm trying to remember. I don't think so. I don't think so. But I do know where there is a backpack nearby. We might go check that out later. But hold on, is this the place? Oh, there it is! I see it! I see it! It's a red pickup truck! Oh, it's the perfect color! <laughs> Every redneck needs a red pickup truck! Oh, it's beautiful! Oh, does it have any car parts? It's got nothing! Nothing at all! We have to fix it up! Completely! We're gonna need four tires, an engine, a spark plug, and a battery. But we have all of that! And gas! Uh, we don't have much gas, though. That is a problem. But it should be enough just to get back to the city. Oh, no, we gotta get Bobby first and try to get the, um... Try to get the workbench, too, in the back of this pickup truck. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, look at that low-quality metal ingot just sitting here. Alright, cool. Let's, uh, let's do the looting first, and then... We will try out this pickup truck. And I'm probably gonna save the game first before we do. Just in case something goes completely bad. Oh! There's a gun over there, and I want to get it. Oh, gas can. Nice. There's anything in that gas can. Oh, just a tiny, tiny little bit. Mostly just fumes, but... Oh! Dang it. It'll do for now. I'm gonna jump up to this. Can I climb up? Yes. And it's an M4, baby. Oh, yes! And some rifle ammo. Fantastic. Let's bring it on up. Load her up. So we have 10 rounds in our M4 now, and we got some more rifle ammo back at the Redneck Shack in the big city. Oh, I want those slippers. They look so comfortable. Yeah, all right, we're gonna have to dismantle this. It's gonna take a really long time. I think it's like 20 minutes for a tire, uh, 20 minutes for the engine. So yeah, we're looking at we're looking at some time here. Let me, um, what time is it? About 11 o'clock, shut off the engine. And, oh, kill the lights. I guess it doesn't matter. We're going to yank that battery anyway. And we're going to have to siphon the gas, actually, aren't we? Let's use this can right here. All right. All right, we got 3.62 liters of gas. Let's transfer it to the pickup truck. We'll start there. Fill up the tank. And we'll leave that can right there in the truck itself. Save on space. Oh, by the way, does this have a trunk? Ah, okay. It doesn't have a trunk for small items, <laughs> but we can put large items and possibly chickenses in the bed. <laughs> Has a back seat though. Awesome. All right, oh, cup holders. Yeah, this is this is prime find right here. This is awesome. All right, let's start uh, pulling this thing apart. We do have one spare tire, right? Yeah, we have one tire here. We have a battery and a spark plug. So we really only need three tires and the engine, right? All right. Well, let's, uh, let's grab that engine. 20 minutes. Okay, engine's in, but now it's time for lunch. Let's climb in the back of the pickup truck here, sit in the bed and have a, uh, have some lunch. <laughs> Can't go any. I can't go in any farther. That's about it. <laughs> All right. What do we have here for choices? We have uh, well, we have a can of meat. Let's go ahead and eat that, and we'll wash that down with a coke. Ah. <sighs> okay. Now back to work. Let's finish this job. Let's hurry up before that miss shows up. We didn't have any miss yesterday, did we? So I bet we're gonna get the miss today. There's a battery and a spark plug. That's only three minutes. And now four tires. Ten minutes apiece, according to my calculations. Beep, 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 beep. That'll be 40 minutes total. All right, two and three. Yeah, it's starting to get late now. It's starting to get late. It's a little bit past two in the afternoon. Still no miss, though. Wow. Have the infected given up or what? They've given up. They better give up. Now they have a redneck truck. 
There's nothing stopping us. Ain't nothing stopping us now. I'm gonna grab everything out of this vehicle. Because I don't know if we're ever coming back here. What did we leave in this car? Anything? Um, let's just grab it all. Might as well. It's only five minutes for that. All right. Oh, <laughs> it just sunk to the ground. Did you see that? Got everything out of the trunk. I am going to miss the trunk for the little items, though. So we are still going to have to have a car like this. I just don't know if it's going to be this one. But this one's going to be better for looting, you know, regular scavenging type days. But this one's going to be great for moving uh, chickens is and, and large items. So, all right. I think we're ready to go. Hop in. I'm driving, of course. Spark it up. Turn on the lights. And hold on to your butts. Hopefully, this thing operates okay. Because I'm hearing a lot of things that is very buggy. I don't want to hit anything. Don't touch anything. Because apparently, it's very sensitive. And it will flip over. And that will be the end of that. So now, let's go get Bobby. We left him at the farm, right? Yeah. All right, let's get to the farm and see if we can get Bobby in the back of this thing. And then we'll try uh, we'll try the workbench, too. Oh, 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 yeah, it's a little shaky. It's a little shaky, but it's okay. Uh-oh. We're at the roadblock. This is where the randits like to ambush people. We're just going to fly right by. I better not shoot my new pickup truck. Yeah, it's a little shaky. Oh, my gosh, you're shooting at the pickup truck. I can't believe it. It's brand new. They better not have scratched this thing. They bet... I will so... Oh, man. I can't believe they shot my truck. Is it okay? I think it's okay. Yeah, we're okay. Yeah, I think um, cars can still take damage if they get shot. But the engines don't wear out just through um, from driving them. We're going to have to loot this big traffic jam over here because it's loaded with goodies. Woo. Uh, but we're not going to do that right now. Let's stick to the plan and fetch Bobby and the workbench. Whoa. Oh, gosh. I feel so high in this truck. Look how high we are. It's like my truck in real life. I've got a Jeep Wrangler with a lift kit. I feel like I'm on top of the world in that thing. So I wonder where that other pickup truck is. I, I, I thought it was at like um like another camp like this. Oh, Popsy bag. <gasps> Let's put Popsy bag in the back of the truck. And we also have a uh, suitcase here. Well, you know, I don't really want the suitcase. Hold on a sec. I don't want to shoot accidentally. Let's grab that out of there. And we're going to put some stuff in the Popsy bag and bring it along. Let's see if it'll actually stay. Can there. Grab that. Of course, I'm going to loot it first. Another suitcase. Wood. Nice battery. And I'm full again. Holy smokes. Look at that. Another gas can here, too. All right. Let's transfer stuff into this suitcase. Just doing a little juggling here. Hang on. Hang on. Okay. So I've got a bunch of stuff in that suitcase and the popsicle bag. Now we should be able to fit this in our inventory. Another gas can's fantastic. And what about weaponry up on top of these campers? Ooh, shotgun shells. Very nice. And a cola, but no gun. All right, well, that's too bad. Let's grab the Popsy bag and go put it in the back of the pickup truck if we can. And that's what this thing is for, right? All right, Popsy. Hold on. Pick it up. And whoop, 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 whoop. Can we get it in? Oh, yes, we can. <laughs> and drop it down. Nice. Let's go grab the suitcase. We might have to make a couple of trips because I want to get that, um, I want to get the workbench. And the workbench is pretty big. So we might have to leave something behind. I don't know. But I want to see if this actually works. Hopefully we don't lose the stuff inside. I guess this is a good way to travel um, with smaller items, right? Bring a few suitcases. All right, it's the moment of truth. I think I'm going to save it here just in case. Here we go. Cross your fingers and your toes and your mud flaps. And let's see if this actually works. Just going to go down the road a little ways. 
Stop. Get out. And look. Okay. Bags are still there. Stuff's still in the... Oh, no. Stuff's not in the bag. Wait, is this the right suitcase? Did I... Wait a minute. I think I grabbed the wrong suitcase. <laughs> you guys are probably flipping out at me. My bad. There were two suitcases over here. I'm just so excited that we have our uh, hillbilly truck that I grabbed the right... Yeah, okay. That's better. Sheesh. Good thing I stopped and checked before we got too far. <laughs> I have a feeling I'm leaving a lot of stuff behind. And you guys are raging at me, but don't worry. Don't worry. We got plenty of episodes to come back for stuff. No big deal. I'm going to leave that suitcase right here on the side of the road for now. Uh... I'm going to have to rotate this a different way, I think. Can, I, can you get up, 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 all the way in the back? Yeah. And make sure you close the gate so that they don't slide out. All right. Very good. Now, um, let's get Bobby next. Okay. I want to make sure we have enough space for Bobby. And Bobby is at the farm. He's at the farm lake, which is, oh gosh, is it getting dark already? Holy smokes. We've been gone a long time. Well, we did rebuild a car, so that's why <laughs> it's so dark right now. That's why it's nighttime. It took forever to put this thing together. Yeah, the workbench is right here. Um, let's go see if we can fit that on here. Yeah, look at this thing. Oh, my gosh, it's giant. I don't know. This might not work. We might have to leave the suitcases behind. Uh, let's try anyway. We're gonna have to rotate it like this. Holy smokes, this thing's giant. Oh my gosh, I, this is bad. Yeah. Alright, let's take it out. Let go. Whoop. Oh, no, no, no. Come on down. I'm gonna put it right here on the side of the road. Uh, let's go get Bobby first. Bobby is a priority, I think. You can't let the poor fella sleep alone again um that's not the right place we gotta go to the farm yeah we really want to bring bobby to the city it was a lonely night last night and we need our a little alarm clock plus i'm curious to see if this actually works <laughs> all right here's our road right here by the motel the lights on man once again these cars just do not have very good headlights Developers got to do something about that. Oh, there he is, Bobby! He's out in front of the old shack waiting. Hi, Bobby! Look what we have, pal. Oh, he loves it. Of course you love it. You're a redneck chicken. Look at him checking it out. <laughs> All right, Bobby, come here, buddy. Come here. I'm going to put you right in the back of this truck, and we're going to bring you to the city. Whee! All right, stay right there. Let me climb up. Get all the way in. No, 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 no. That's dangerous. Down. Two feet down, okay? All right, Bobby. Stay right there. All right? I don't have a seatbelt for you, though. Oh, no. No, Bobby. Uh-oh. I don't think we can take Bobby. Maybe if I put him on the suitcases. All right, stay right there. Yeah, okay, that's good, too. Right on the, <laughs> right on the roof. <laughs> All right, Bobby, you good? Hold on with those little chicken feet. Here we go, Bobby. Yes, it's going to work. All right, we're going to turn it around. Hold on, Bobby. Keep your wings down. Oh, this is perfect. It's going to work. It's a long way to go, though. Oh, Bobby, you're shaking the truck. Relax up there. Whatever you're doing, stop. Oh, my gosh. I don't think this is going to work. Oh, nope. I can't get up this little hill. Bobby, I might have to put you in the back, in the way, 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 way back, okay? Because that doesn't seem like it's working. Yes, right there. I heard I heard the kachung. I think that's a good that's a good sign. Now I can't see him though. I can see him. I can see him in the back there. Alright, hang on, Bobby. <laughs> Plus we can hear him. He's still squawking. He loves it. I wish the rear view mirror worked, does it? I don't think so. Okay, I think we're gonna come back for the workbench. We have Bobby and we have a couple of bags full of some loot. The workbench is gonna take up too much space. So we are going to hold off on that. Let's see if we can get Bobby and our bags back at the very least. Oh, this is amazing. Bobby is still back there? Oh, yeah. He loves it. 
All that fresh air, the wind blowing through his feathers. Real nice. Is that work best? <laughs> you do like it. I know you do. It's a red pickup truck. Got plenty of gas to get home as long as we don't smash the car. We should be okay. Although I am a little concerned about the bandits up here. With Bobby back there, he's very exposed. I don't want him to get shot. Oh, there's a battery right there. We'll come back for that stuff later. Oh, oh. Still back there, Bobby? Yep. All right, pecking away at the luggage. All right, Bobby. We're going through the uh, the roadblock here. Sometimes there's bandits. They take shots at you. Keep your little chicken head down. I'm going to try to go through here as fast as possible without hitting anything. Oh, gosh. I don't see any bandits. Do you? Head down, Bobby. We're in the clear. Uh-oh. Bobby? Oh, he's still there. I thought he fell off. That would have been the worst place. <laughs> All right, we're almost there, Bobby. About halfway. He's holding on for dear life. And I don't blame him. I remember back when I was a kid, we used to ride in the back of pickup trucks. That was fun. Can't do it anymore, though. It's a, you'll, you'll be fined. It's a crime. <laughs> I mean, it is kind of dangerous if you think about it. Putting kids in the back of a pickup truck, flopping around. Whoa! Oh! Okay, we got rough terrain here, Bobby. Hold on. Oh, no. I hope the bushes and stuff don't wreck engines, because they used to. He's still there. All right, we got one more bandit base to pass, Bobby. Keep your head down, because there's a sniper here. All right, we got to go really fast here. I don't want Bobby to get sniped. There it is. There it is. I don't want to go too fast, though. <laughs> I don't want to hit anything. All right, we made it. This is the highway to the city. Is he still there? Bobby, all right, yeah, keep checking in, okay? I can't see you in the rear view. It's broken. All right, we're almost there. I think this has been our greatest adventure of all time. Bobby thinks so, too. <laughs> Bobby, you're going to love the city. Two rednecks in the city with our redneck pickup truck. This is awesome. This game just gets better and better and better. And I can't believe it's made by one guy. So awesome. I love it. All right, we're going to park right here for now. And kill the lights. Kill the engine. And hop out. And it's still sunny. And Bobby! You made it, buddy! Awesome! Let's go bring Bobby to the shack. This is our motel property. I bought it. It was on sale, basically free. And here you go, pal. You get the run of this place. You can just run around right in here and nobody can hurt you. And you'll be perfectly safe, little buddy. So I'm going to go ahead and dump this stuff out. Oh, my gosh. Or I'm not because there's no space anywhere. But look at that pickup truck in the city. It's amazing. It's perfect. All right. Let's open the gate. Pick up the suitcase. Drop it. And we are truly packed up and moving to, moving to the city in this episode, right? That's so awesome! I can't wait to go get that workbench now. What time is it? I'm so tempted, but I don't like driving in the dark in this game. The, the headlights on these cars is, are terrible. You can't really see anything in the dark. All right. Open that bag up and unload it, Bobby. Come on, you got to pitch in. Everybody pitches in here. And this little fella. And that's it. We are literally moving to the city. From the hills. The hillbillies are here, everybody. The OG crew is back together. <laughs> Bobby, the redneck therapy chicken, is back in town. Actually, this is your first trip to the city. Yes, it is. You're absolutely right. Would you like to take a tour? You want to go take a tour of the city? I haven't even see, seen the whole city, Bobby. What do you say? Should we take Bobby for a little little tour? I don't think we should do that at night, though. It's a dangerous place at night, Bobby. So we're just going to stay in here for the night. And I am going to get organized, unload my bags. Looks like I'm going to have to make another uh, locker. Although now, now we can just go collect lockers in the pickup truck. And bring them all back here. Save on materials, right? 
Holy smokes, this is crazy. It's so awesome. Oh, gosh. I am thirsty. Drink some water. Yes, I am neglecting my bodily needs because I'm so stoked about this. Love it. All right. I think we're just going to call it quits right here for now. Let's just check the engine parts. Everything okay? Yeah, it's not chewing through engine parts. Like I said, that's been disabled for this particular update. Um, and I'm not sure about the gas. I'm not sure if it's using gas. I didn't happen to notice. But gas will respawn for now, at least until the developer has a method of creating our own gas, which we are going to be able to do at some point. So that's going to be awesome. All right. Well, I guess that's it for now, folks. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And uh, you know what? Should we park the, let's park the pickup truck inside here. I know we don't really need to because it's perfectly safe out here, but I just feel like it's the right thing to do. We might as well. And hopefully it doesn't freak out on us. This is a good test. Park it right in here in the motel property. All right. Kill the engine and out we go. And close the gates. <laughs> All right. Very good. The rednecks are here, everybody. See you all tomorrow. So that's it for now, folks. Hope you enjoyed. And we'll see you next time. Oh, Bobby, it's so good to have you back, little buddy. You want to sleep in the shack with me tonight? It's nice grass in here you can peck. No? You want to explore a little? Okay, don't go too far. All right. Good night. Oh, man, I don't have a window here. I can't look out on Bobby. Make sure he's okay. <laughs> there he is. All right, good night, Bobby. We'll see you tomorrow. Wake me up at 7. All right? 7 a.m. sharp. You got it? Bobby? Did you hear me? 7 a.m. sharp. You got it? Thank you. Just wanted that confirmation. Good night. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.